the Holy Ghost. Good time in the Lord tonight. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I'm excited what God is doing in this time and season that we're in. Amen. I simply ask everybody to share the broadcast. Tap the little man on the right hand side. Scroll down and hit share. Tap the little man on the right hand side. Scroll down and hit share again. Tap the little man on the right hand side. Scroll down and hit share. We are going to have a Holy Ghost good time tonight on Periscope. I am excited what God is doing in this time and season that we're in. Amen. And I thank God for each and every one of you, my friends. God is doing some great and mighty things in this season that we're in. Amen. How many of y'all know God doing some great and mighty things? Just tap that screen right now. Give God some hearts. We know that God is doing some great and mighty things in this season. Because God is doing some great and mighty things in this season that we're in. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, my friends, God is doing some great things right now. I'm telling you, my friends, God is going to shake up the foundation. God is going to send healing to the land right now in the mighty name of Jesus. I'm telling you, my friends, God is doing some great and mighty things in this season. Hallelujah. You need to catch on what God is doing. God is doing a great and mighty thing in this season right now in the mighty name of Jesus. God is doing some great and mighty things right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Again, my friend, this is Prophet Derek Young live on Periscope. It's about 545 Eastern Standard Time here, 545 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Amen. I'm just so excited what God is doing in this season. Amen. And Lord, I've been, you know, reading the Bible and praying and meditating today. And the Lord dropped, dropped one of, um, amen, this verse in my spirit, amen, um, several years ago. Actually, a lady was was healed through my ministry from a brain tumor. Amen. Several several years ago, a lady was healed. Amen. From my ministry from a brain tumor. Amen. About 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 seven eight years ago, a lady she was healed from a brain tumor. She had a brain tumor. Amen. I sent her a prayer cloth in the mail. Amen. And um, and I'm telling you, she went back to the hospital. The lady called me and say, God healed me. God healed me. The doctors couldn't believe it. Amen. So God is still a healer. Amen. Amen. And the Lord has confirmed me to me year after year. Amen. That, that that also he has a healing anointing on my life as well. He has a healing anointing on my life as well. Amen. Not only am I a prophet of the Lord. Amen. The prophets should have some type of level of healing anointing as well. Amen. That that follows that prophetic office. Amen. That follows that prophetic mandate. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. So what we're going to do, we, we want to try to get as many people we on, that we can have on tonight. I need everybody to tap the little man on the right hand side, scroll down and hit share. Tap the little man on the right hand side, scroll down and hit share. We're going to have a Holy Ghost good time in the Lord tonight. Amen. Tap the little man on the right hand side, scroll down and hit share. Tap the little man on the right hand side, scroll down and hit share. We're going to have a Holy Ghost good time tonight in the Lord, my friends. God going to do some great and mighty things in this season that we in. Glory be to God. I thank God for each and every one of you, my friends. God just doing some great and mighty things in this season that we're in. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Somebody give God some praise. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. I want to talk, amen, a little about uh, Acts chapter 19, verse 11 and verse 12. Acts chapter 19, verse 11 and verse 12. People, that, people that's coming in, amen, just share the broadcast. Tap the little man on the right-hand side. Scroll down and hit share. Tap the little man on the right-hand side. Scroll down and hit share. People that's coming in, amen, share the broadcast. Hallelujah, if you don't mind. Also, keep those hearts coming for the Lord. As you keep those hearts coming for the Lord, amen, the Lord, um, you know, will pull up my anointing, amen, and allow me to really be a blessing to you this afternoon, amen, this evening, no matter where you are, amen. Acts chapter 19, verse 11 and 12 says, God did extraordinary miracles, amen, through Paul. So that even handkerchief or apron would touch him, amen, and were taken to the sick, and their illnesses were cured, and evil spirits left them, amen. It says God did extraordinary miracles through a Paul, amen. So that even handkerchiefs and aprons that touch him were taken to the sick, and their illnesses were cured, and evil spirits, amen, left them. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. As we as we analyze this text. Amen. We can we can see, Amen, that that people place handkerchiefs and aprons on the Apostle Paul, Amen. And and when those handkerchiefs and aprons were placed on Paul, Amen, they was taken, Amen, to people that were sick, and they were healed, and people that had demons, Amen, demons left out of these people as well, 
Amen. But my friend, look, the the, the handkerchief or apron did not do, amen, the miracle. It was the healing anointing that God had on Apostle Paul's life. That's how the miracles were done, amen. If they were to place a pen on Paul and they would have put it on somebody, they would have been healed, amen. It was not the handkerchief or the apron it was the anointing of God, amen. It was the anointing of the Lord, amen, that was on Apostle Paul's life, amen. And I believe, my friends, as I mentioned earlier, amen, I have had several people that have connected to my ministry over the years were healed of various diseases. Had a woman about eight years ago, eight or nine years ago, had a brain tumor up in New Jersey, amen. And I sent her a prayer cloth in the mail, amen. Hallelujah, that prayer cloth at the time, amen, was a point of contact between me and the lady. Glory be to God. And God healed this lady from a brain tumor. Amen. God healed this lady from a brain tumor, my friends. I stopped by here tonight to tell you that God still heals, that God still delivers, and God still set free. Amen. The same God that parted the Red Sea in the Old Testament can heal you right now today. Amen. The same God that gave the Israelites manna and quail to eat when they was going through the wilderness, amen, can bless you beyond your wildest imagination, amen. The same God that rose his only begotten son, Jesus Christ from the dead, could work a special miracle in your life. God still heals. God still does miracles. God still delivers. He still sets free. We don't serve a God that is dead and gone. We serve a God that is full of power. We serve a God that releases healing anointings in people's lives. We, we serve a God, amen, that can heal you, amen, hallelujah. When Jesus healed my great, great aunt, hallelujah, I was 18 years old. She only had two hours to live. She only had two hours to live, and Jesus Christ healed her. Hallelujah. Again, I'm talking about Acts chapter 19, verse 11 and 12. The aprons and handkerchiefs did not do the healing. The anointing that was on Apostle Paul's life produced the healing that happened. Glory be to God. It ain't, ain't had nothing to do with no, anchor, no handkerchief or apron. They could have put a pen on Paul or, or a piece of paper or, 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 or something, amen, and took it and put on that, that person that was sick and they would have been healed, amen. It was the anointing that was on Apostle Paul's life, amen. And I just believe right now, glory be to God, that hallelujah, that when you Email me. I love my email address, amen, on the Periscope broadcast. When you email me your prayer requests, when I print them out, and when I pray over them, amen, that thing's going to begin to take place in your life. That healing going to take place in your life, amen. That deliverance going to take place in your life. I believe it right now that God is going to get ready to do a supernatural miracle in your life right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I stopped by here tonight to tell you that God still heals, that God still delivers, that God still set free. Whatever you need the Lord to do for you, amen, God is willing and able to do it for you. And God told me to t God told me today to tell the saints to email you, amen. He gave me specific instructions to print out the prayer requests, amen, and pray over them. And I believe some supernatural miracles going to take place in y'all lives. Amen. I believe some people are going to be healed on Periscope. Glory be to God. I believe your loved one going to be healed on Periscope. Hallelujah. Because the power of God is going to get ready to move through our prayer requests. And, and oftentimes, growing up in Missionary Baptist Church, amen, we was taught that touching and agreeing in prayer together was sitting there holding each other's hand. Amen. But that's not touching and agreeing in prayer. I don't care where you are in this world. Amen. If you and I have enough faith to believe that God's going to do a miracle in your life, we are touching and agreeing in prayer. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. I don't care if you in in California. And I'm here in Florida. If you and I have the, the, the level of faith to believe that God can heal, amen, we're touching and agreeing in prayer. We ain't got to be standing around the altar holding hands, amen. God is a God of supernaturalism. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. And, and, and I believe the same anointing, amen, that flows through Apostle Paul 
In that particular time in the Bible, amen, it's going to get ready to flow, amen, right now. Why? Because we're in the last days, amen, and God's going to make one last attempt to show the world his power before Jesus Christ come back. Amen. It's going to be a great season of miracles. You're going to begin to see it happen. You're going to say, Prophet Young told me it's going to happen. Amen. You're going to begin to see it happen. There's going to be a great season of miracles. Amen. The lame shall be able to walk. The blind shall be able to see. The, the deaf should be able to hear. The mute should be able to speak. The dead will raise up. Amen. God is going to get ready to do some miracles right now. Hallelujah. He's going to get ready to do some miracles right now. God is going to get ready to do some supernatural miracles right now. Hallelujah. He's going to get ready to do some supernatural miracles right now. God is going to get ready to do some miracles right now. And I want to pray for you. I want to pray for you. Amen. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. I want, I want to pray for you. Amen. You need to email me at Derek Young Ministries, INC at Yahoo.com. I got my email address on this Periscope um, broadcast right here, the one I'm on. You need to email me at Derek Young Ministries, INC at Yahoo.com. You need to email me at Derek Young Ministries, INC at Yahoo.com. Amen. I'm going to print your prayer request out. I'm going to pray over your request. I'm going to pray over it, amen. And I believe that God's going to do a supernatural miracle in your life. I believe that God's going to heal you. I believe that God's going to deliver you. I believe that the Lord's going to do it, my friend. If you believe that God's going to do something for you supernatural, I need you to tap that screen right now and give God some hearts. If you believe that God's going to give it to do something for you supernatural, I need you to tap that screen right now and give God some hearts because we serve a God that is full of the supernatural power. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Lord, for the healings you're about to do. As the people email me, Lord, I thank you for the healings that you're about to do right now, Lord God. As the people email me, Lord, I thank you for the deliverance that you're about to get ready to do right now in the vest, Lord God. I thank you for the financial bondage, amen, that you're about to bring people out of right now. As they email me, Lord God, I thank you, Lord God, for healing people of mental health, from, from delivering people from homosexuality to lesbianism, from healing people from all various diseases, amen, no matter what it is, Lord, I thank you in advance for releasing this healing, miracle anointing, amen, on my life, Lord God, I thank you in advance, I believe right now, I believe, amen, that when people email me, God, they're going to be healed, delivered and set free by your power, Lord God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Amen. You need to email me. Some of you are going to watch this, this video and, re, and replay. Amen. You need to email. You need to email me at Derek Young Ministries, INC at Yahoo.com. Derek Young Ministries, INC at Yahoo.com. I'm going to print out every request. Amen. I'm going to pray over them. Amen. I'm going to anoint them and I'm going to pray over them. Amen. And I'm going to believe God for the supernatural. I'm going to believe God for the supernatural, amen. I'm going to believe God for the impossible, amen. Hallelujah. We serve a God that can make the things that seem impossible, he can make it possible. Matter of fact, when you take the, the letters I am out of impossible, it, it writes the word possible, amen. So I believe, amen, that no matter what you're going through today, that God has the power, amen, to bring you out of that situation. Glory be to God. When you email me your prayer request at Derek Young Ministries, amen, INC at Yahoo.com, amen, we're going to touch and agree in prayer, amen, and God's going to do something impossible for you. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. I need everybody to share this broadcast. I need everybody to share right now. Hallelujah. I need everybody to share right now. Glory be to God. Somebody going to experience a move from the Lord tonight. Somebody going to experience a move from the Lord tonight. Somebody going to experience a mighty move from the Lord tonight. Hallelujah. Somebody going to experience a mighty move from the Lord. I'm telling you, my friends, God is moving by his power and by his might. Hallelujah. He's moving by his power and by his might right now. Glory be to God. I'm excited what God is doing in this season. God is just doing some great and mighty things in this season that we're in, my friends. Again, Acts chapter 19, amen, that's my, my, my scriptural reference, amen, point from Acts chapter 19, verse 11 and 12. 
Amen. It says God did extraordinary miracles through Paul. Amen. So that even when handkerchiefs and aprons had touched him, they were placed on the sick and they were healed of their illnesses and the cured and evil spirits. Amen. Left them. Amen. But like I said, amen, it wasn't the apron. Amen. It wasn't the handkerchief. It was the healing anointing that God had on Apostle Paul's life. And that's how the miracles took place. Amen. It was the healing anointing that God had on Apostle Paul's life. Amen. I don't, I don't care what type of material they would have put on the skin, amen, and, and put it on the sick people, and they would have been healed because of the healing anointing that God had on Apostle Paul's life, the healing anointing. And I believe that right now. Amen. We serve the same God that's the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. God the Father's healing power is not gone. You got to be able to believe it, and you got to be able to receive it right now. Hallelujah. You got to be able to receive it and you got to be able to believe it amen again i want you to email me email me i'm telling you email me your prayer request if you want me to give you a call back leave a contact number amen i'll call you back amen email me your prayer request at Derek young ministries inc at yahoo.com my email address is with this particular periscope broadcast go on this particular periscope broadcast and, and look at my email address and email me amen i'm telling you God going to do some great things for you. Miracles going to take place. Lives going to be changed. I believe it right now today, amen, in Jesus' mighty name. Look, friends, I just wanted to come to you, amen, to, to do this particular segment, amen, to let you know that prayer changes things. And the Bible declares that the prayers of the righteous are powerful and effective. Amen. As you email me your prayer requests, amen, I'm going to print them out. I'm going to anoint them, and I'm going to pray for them. And I believe that God going to do some great things in store for you, my friends. I'm going to get ready to sound this particular broadcast. I'll be back live again in a few minutes. Amen. But I just want to just let you know I love and I appreciate you. In Jesus' mighty name, I'll be waiting for your emails. I'm going to personally reply to your emails as well. I'm going to be waiting for God to do your miracle for you. In Jesus' mighty name. God bless you.